Hi everyone! <laughs> it literally feels like it's been forever since I've recorded any episodes for anything. But, here we are with a new game. Um, as I announced my vlog, we are doing Life is Strange. And here we are, look how gorgeous this looks. I'm so excited to play. I haven't recorded anything for any playthroughs or anything since my last Spider-Man episode, which is up as of now obviously um and that was about a month ago i've just been really behind on, on editing and uploading for y'all so here we are <laughs> i'm gonna try and be better about this 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 time around so i apologize for that but i'm so excited this is literally a game i've been so excited to play for so long um i've heard it's very artistic and very um like arts artsy and indie music isn't it i guess i don't know story-based game that features player choice consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past present and future Ooh. <laughs> So sur it was so surreal. Was so surreal. Famously called film, little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, so as class. he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. <laughs> Everything's cool. I am okay. I don't remember her name. To shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, what a bitch. can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless face. Look at this crap. How can That's I show cute. this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Who the fuck cares? This. Bye. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. I can't believe I still have She's this pencil case. Tortured, right? I should upgrade to the 21st That's century. I guess. But I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Seriously though. Me too. I could frame any one of you in it. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? I don't care. Oh, her name's Max. That's what it was. Okay. Dark okay. corner. Anyway. And capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. I don't like the way he's talking. Isn't okay. that too easy? I do love my analog camera. What I should take a quick picture now. Why? You're in class. Their innocence. She had a brilliant eye. So, she could have taken another approach. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan. Shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic class. tradition. So, and Max okay. has a gift. 
Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The, the point remains class, that the portraiture know. has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Um, you're asking me? You're asking me? <laughs> L let me think. <laughs> me too, girl. Um, you either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Jesus. Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a like sharp her. reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Did she just say sad face? Very good, Victoria. <laughs> the Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. Book. Or even online. Oh and guys, don't forget Whoa. the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Yeah, I don't miss anything about high school besides theater. This all sh Not my thing. Uh, all right. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Oh, she left her shit behind. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she? Of course, Victoria has to. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. It's an expensive ass camera. No camera should be worth like that much. Who's this? Hi, Kate. Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. She needs to sleep. No matter who wins. Kate, I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Sure. Paperball? Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. Purge. Porn video. Gross. She doesn't seem like the kind of person to have something like that. Yeah, Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Bye. Out suckers. I see you, Max Caulfield. Oh. <laughs> Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Alright. Oh I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Um, I didn't have any time. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max. You're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but really life won't old. wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Well, shit. Okay, bye. Get the fuck out of here. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I, feel like you have to you always I don't think I ever said those words ever before. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture of her in class. Why are they making fun of me right in front of me? <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. Preach me. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. That sounds like high school. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant camera. Why do y'all care? Ooh, I like the vibe. This is a nice vibe. Life is Strange, Episode 1, Chrysalis. Well, Evan is nice Evan hair. doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. Locker. To all of you. Ooh, I like this vibe. I love that picture of Mom and Dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous. Is that Andy Warhol? 
Girl, a little bit of art. I'd like to be part of the world around. Hey, whores, get away from him. Driving a Poor car by he's the so nice. I wish beat the I shit out of him. Jack straps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. Oh, it's orange. You can't see it. Whatever. It's cute. Can I get in her way? <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. I wish October would last forever. That's a moon. October is the best month of the it year. Like best horror movies always come out. The same girl. Okay, that's always rough. They should just call it a sugar machine. <laughs> that would be awesome. Where is the bathroom? Money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. With shiny smiles and plastic buddies. Principal doesn't come out of his office much. I wish I had. Miss Grant? Miss Grant is a great science teacher. She looks like my old science teacher. Alright, where's the bathroom? How many students ever actually memorize all this shit? I guess we all should these days. On the left side? It has to be around here somewhere, right? Such a weirdo. But I kinda like that about him. She's a bitch, okay. Uh, let's just oh there it is, okay. I cry sometimes walking around my empty good. Nobody can see my meltdown except for me. <laughs> me. Now, who would bother to write that crap? An asshole, that's who. I love they can actually see her in the mirror. You usually can't do that in other games. Spider Man, the last time I'm looking I got at a you. Flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. What are you, an anti vaxxer or something? Illuminati confirmed. This poster must drive people to have sex. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? Maybe. But the best people are. <laughs> I love how her hair doesn't move when she moves around. Like stays like Just that. relax. Yeah. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. It's a cute picture. Fuck it. No! That's a cute pic- Whatever. Is that a butterfly? When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. They the Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Okay. Oh my god. I need to get my contacts. Does shaking it actually help? Cause I don't actually know if it does. Is that a guy? Why are you in the girls' restroom, dude? Get the it's fuck cool, out of here. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. Honey, don't be doing that. So what do you want? I nice hope you hair. check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. Honest. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. His name's Nathan. You don't know who the fuck I oh, am shit. or who you're oh, messing shit. around with. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Dude, what are you doing? Dude, chill the fuck out. Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No. Not a fan, not a fan. Whoa. Whoa. What the fuck? How? 
How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. What the hell? Is she, can she time travel? Is that what this game's about? I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. Can we stop and it? Victoria's phone rings. This is real. Now, oh, shit! Can you give me an example of a Damn, photographer? I cannot believe this. That's so expensive. In black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Why are Hold L2. Because of her images of hope. Ooh. Images of hopeless. Okay, this is really fucking cool. Whoa. Okay. And am I gonna go all the way back at the end of the little swivel? Okay, I think it's a yes. I did it. Can you give me I an actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured I'm a the human, human time machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, Diane. don't freak out. Arvis. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images. Keep it together, Max. Spaces. You feel like totally haunted by uh, the eyes of those sad mothers selfie? and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? When I took my selfie, Frankly, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition, and Max has a gift. <laughs> I know I'm not dreaming course, this. As you all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if, what if that girl isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please okay, tell us good. the name of the... Um, I feel sick. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me what after class. I don't have time for this. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like, like a, a mirror. mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Face. She's such a bitch. Oh, God, <laughs> what if I rewind again? This icon means it's a useful fact that you may be able spaces, to use if you making rewind. Them rewind. I just said W what twice. Rewind. Oh, I don't like that. It's so creepy. Can I hear that right? I hate voices backwards. It always sounds really weird. Oh, I can run faster. Thank God. Max. Uh, the Daguerrean process. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis, Louis Daguerre, Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. I wish I was a studious. <sighs> St studious. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. But you can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. Yippee hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Okay, can't skip it. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. Oh, that's cute. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Victoria, oh, wait. you still have to do your homework this week. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody... I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even <laughs> think about leaving here until we talk about your interest. Um, I don't want to. Sis. I'd never let one of photographers... Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not avoiding. I'm not avoiding. Just... just biding time? Waiting for the elusive, elusive right, right moment. moment? Exactly. Max? <laughs> She's so cute. Don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. I made a choice just now? We'll have to do your homework this week. Even okay. if you're Excuse me. Oh. Uh, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, no. Victoria. 
Excuse <laughs> us. I'd never let one of the- Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. I wish I could Make do sure this you in real life. Make sure frippin' awesome. I have faith in you. Frippin'? Really, Ryan? Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go save that girl. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Just please, fucking run. Please, Sprint I can't down tell the anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Y yeah, you probably will. It's a very... There it is. Science okay, classes? Max, retrace every step. <laughs> I remember this up in Bill Nye. Science rules. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. For then the reason. butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you what doing? Can I do? Come don't on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Well, I'm, I'm too scared, scared to get near this psycho. Okay. Tell me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Fire, fire alarm? I need a hammer to break it open. Your punk ass, would they? Um. Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. Holy shit! I can't let this happen. No. If I can reverse time again, I can help. I am not affected by the rewind. You can you retain facts and inventory Shit. objects. I need to yeah, rewind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do something fast. I hear fast. you. I hear you. More trouble for this than drugs. Uh, no way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. Jesus. Another shitty day. Put the gun away before running out into a school. You that did idiot. not happen. This cannot be real. Let's get the fuck out of here. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Um, why? Do I guess. Freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I'm going. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? What's this guy's issue? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn <gasps> off that alarm since that's your job. Yeah, bitch. Go do your job, bitch. <laughs> Do I need to, I don't want to say school. Let's get the hell out of here. Babbage. 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 Hold on, Max. Come back here. Why? Why am I back here? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm in school. I'm just a little worried about my future. Really? You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Why does everyone think I did is something wrong? It? Well, Max, talk to me. Report Nathan or hide the truth. I mean, he did pull a gun, so... I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. Yeah. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding Logic, behind right? a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family. Okay. And one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... Then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is... A serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. This would not happen Please in real life. Please go outside with the rest of your class. At least class. you better not. Ms. Caulfield? You talk about how... 
Of course, this academic drone is doing things access. since the Prescott family you. owns Blackwell now. Yeah, fuck you. Around here. Get on outside. I'm not gonna change that action. I don't think it's worth it. Um, I feel like reporting him was the right thing to do. Oh, this is pretty. Blackwell Academy. Alrighty. I love the music so far, too. It just, it adds to it, it makes it really, like, atmospheric, you know? Would Nathan Prescott please come to the front office? Thank you. Alright, what am I trying to do? I don't think they would really fucking care. Warren? What? What, what, what? Okay, uh, do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse on to study. Please make sure you check your neck romantic on my flash drive. Mwahaha. Hey, Mad Max, let's budge, let's bust shit up. Wait, I have to say for a physics test, but, so if you bust anything, we also have to measure its velocity. <laughs> Don't ignore this message. Hi, Max, can you get my flash drive? I need some info and space. Hello? Sorry, running late. It's an insane day. I'll meet you in a lot looking cool. You'll see. My hair will be ready. See you shortly. Alright. Oh, okay. So I have a message from my mom. Happy birthday, Maxine. I can't believe it's been 18 whole years since you were brought to us, XO. Kate. Oh, my eye. Okay. Hey, Max. You around? Always. You okay? Did you want to get tea later today? Absolutely. I'll be free after four. Talk to you later. Dad. You have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, but you're still a little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. Fun. Okay. I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Alright. Where are the dorms? What's this? Oh, this is a cute guy from the hallway. Evan, that's his name. Hey, Evan. I would ever do this in my life. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Um, Eugene Smith. Gotta be Eugene Smith. Well, they both were famous war photographer images, but... You should know the difference. Who was it Good then? Try. Wrong answer. Okay. Robert Kappa. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My my. This quiet child knows. He's not as cute from the same. That's why I'm here. But you know, You're his hair is cool. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored. He's a sir. prick. I don't like him. <gasps> These photos are great. And Rachel Amber's face is mesmerizing. Who's Rachel Amber? Okay. Dorms. Oh, that's what I was trying to do. Let's go, beach. <laughs> Bring it, bro. <laughs> so yeah. stupid. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Oh, hey, Alyssa. Hi, Max. Hey, honey. Uh, how are you? How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon okay. I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. I think you're better off reading chiclet. Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. Okay. Why are these guys in the dorm? It's the girls' dorm, right? I'm assuming. Can you please move? Oh, look. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. All right. That's an interesting title. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. Okay. Why do you care? The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. Why do you care? I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Again, why do you care? Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. You're going to be like moving. that, really? Oh, wait. Hold that pose. Uh... What a so fucking original. bitch. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, yeah. why don't you go fuck your selfie? Hmm. Oh, yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. 
I might have said. None shall pass. Capiche? Who the fuck says capiche? The door's open. Let's go in here. Water pump. That's what I want, so let's do that last. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Hmm. Okay. Awesome. Did they not leave? Can I still not go? They said something about that water. Nice. Can I get it before he comes down, maybe? Oh, yeah, you're fine. Alright. Uh, tamper with it. Alright. Okay, let's see if this works. That part, because this is just dumb. Okay. Oh, my water hurts. My water hurts, my eye hurts. No way! <gasps> no fucking way! Okay, Victoria? Oh, Sandy, oh sorry. shit. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. That's what the fuck inside. I'm tired of this bullshit, Victoria. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? See, I'm a very nice person, so what I would do is comfort her. Even though she's a bitch and doesn't sorry. deserve it. That's an awesome cashmere coat. Just make her like us, maybe. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. Maybe she won't be a bitch to us anymore. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. No. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourself See, she that could was be a good person. Mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Maybe we can become friends with her and she can help All influence right, well. stuff. She say Erova. I don't even know how to say it correctly, but Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. I don't know. I'm too nice to do shit like that. I don't care about drama. Like in high school, if any of my high school friends or whatever are watching this, y'all know I didn't do shit. I did not care. Room two seventeen. No way in hell am I ever <laughs> going in here. We took so long. Taylor is a slave. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Yikes. What am I doing? Go Miss Grant. Not sure if I will, though. I'm a loser. Fair enough. Welcome to Black Hill. Isn't that kind of dangerous to have shit like that? This is a bathroom. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. What's down here? Showers? Okay. Oh, so the community showers. That sucks. I didn't have that at school. Okay, this is just mean and stupid. Yeah, bye. We're not gonna deal with that negativity. There you go, Max. Why would that action have consequences? It's just me being nice. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. And my iPad's about to die. Hold on. Let me get the charger. Alright, what's to say? 314 pie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you're so funny. Max's room. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Relatable. Draw something. Just be cute. My hair's sticking up. Gross. 
What did I write? That's a fucking mood, though. Alright, let's go. That socket was freaking huge. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Ooh, this is so cute. This is super cute. Alright, what's in here? Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Aww, that's cute. That's what healthy parents look like. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. <laughs> she sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. It's me. not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. That's all that's needed. It doesn't have to be good for you to be Would happy. Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? I can play guitar. I wish I could play guitar. I can play bass guitar. Fun fact. But I can't... play play. Alright, I don't care. <laughs> uh, that's cool though. I really wish I could play guitar. I just don't have the patience for it. And that's why I play bass guitar. Because it's... I'm glad it's Kate hard, let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I should have every for Bradbury book for myself. Work with. I'm glad Kate yeah, let me borrow yeah, her yeah. copy of Instant Film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. I mean, it's in But I can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always, Always looking. looking. Can I water? Let me water my plant. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. Why will me watering my plant have... I what? haven't forgotten you, little Lisa. Yet. Okay. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HDTV. Fair enough. Looks like Dana left me a little post Hi girl, I borrowed a drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need it back, just track me down my room. So it's a D. Great. Who's D? Now I have to go get the oh, flash Dana. drive from Dana's room. What's in my computer? I am so Camera porn. To sight. Look at these vintage beauties. Okay. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. My man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. I'm trying to get into photography, so this is making me so excited and want to do stuff. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. Her dad is so cute. Aww. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. <laughs> Those are cute. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what oh, she'll say. Oh, it's a friend from earlier. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Why don't you call your own damn friend back? Okay, uh, let's go get that um, flash drive down from Dana. I don't remember which one's Dana's room. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell Never me the mind. truth or rot in there. Okay, let's go see what the fuck's going on, because I have shit to do. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. You are ridiculous. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Oh, man. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Um... Olsen. Juliet... Ju Juliet Olsen. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Watson. Alright, well, bitch, let me go answer again. Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. Hey, I'm Juliet. This is so stupid. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. No, I'm a nice person. Uh, of course I do. 
thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. Would Dana do that? Would Dana do that? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. Who the fuck cares According about dating to quarterbacks? Huh. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. But she didn't do Straight it. Straight to hell. Okay. Alright, I think her room was down here because there was a Gandhi quote, right? Yeah, there it is. And of course she left the door open. Alright. That's... Oh, her room's cute. This is cute. Man, I wish I had a cute room. Look at my room. My room's fucking trash. Alright, where would it be? Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Okay, whatever. What's on her laptop? I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print so this fast and get the, the hell out of here. Yikes. Print email. Like we're in 19... No, like we're in 2008. <laughs> All right, let's get the fuck out of here. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Oh, y'all are photographers, I meaning y'all know how to work um, Photoshop, so. I mean, would it really be that questionable? Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I exactly. owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. Uh-oh. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Compared to these girls, Max just seems like really like awkward. So Almost done. Get the interesting. flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. All right, where the pre pregnancy test? That looks like a home pregnancy test. I'm not gonna mess with that. Not my Must business. Protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. Okay. We're gonna pretend none of that happened. Let's, what, what? Bye. <laughs> he texts like an eight year old. All right, I don't know, that's strange. I love, I also like how there's not long loading screens on these, so that makes it nice. Fuck this shit. Ow, that hurt. Damn, I better rewind. Hell yeah. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. <laughs> now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Hell yeah. Why will my action have consequences? By the way, thanks, but we're not friends. Okay, honey. I won't make us friends. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything I here guy. at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. What would taking a photo do? Let's intervene. Like, yo, bitch, back the fuck hey, off my girl. Why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us. This is official campus business. Excuse me. You shouldn't be yelling yeah. at students or bullying them. Hey, bitch. Hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Okay. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Aww, Anytime. She's Kate. so cute. 
I felt like an everyday hero. Okay. Fuck with me. What's his name? Marston? No, that's the guy from Red Dead, right? Jack Marston? No, that's the kid. John Marston. I don't remember his name. See, I was at school for a semester, I can guarantee that's not what it looks like every single day. But, you never know. Right, I see Warren, let's go. Let's see what's the deal. I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. No, ma'am. Yo, Max, check it out. What's up, What bud? up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. <laughs> No problem. Yeah, utter friend zone, bro. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong it's time. Long way away. But then so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face Is full this of license paint. Plate said the I paid money to see a photo of that. <laughs> Funny. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? What? Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from Akira to Twilight Zone, which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. Mm -hmm. That does sound better than thief. <laughs> ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Oh, that movie's freaky. Seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies I'm, like, than dying. that. Can a sensitive high school boy love sensitive vampires too? So you're sure. sensitive. Ouch. That sounds awful the way you say it. How so? Sensitive usually means won't be having sex with you. Oh God, you need a sensitive woman to kick your ass. If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. It's the second time he's mentioned a movie in this one conversation. Uh, we need, I need to, talk. to talk to somebody. Somebody. Just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Cool. Tell me everything. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take okay. pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal now. What the fuck are you talking about? Answer what are you me, talking bitch. About? I know you're new here, but don't even play stupid with me. I'm not new. I've lived here for years. Then you should know the Prescotts own this shithole. Then you don't have to worry about me. Worry about yourself. Do not analyze me. I pay people for that. This is honest. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Who calls you about first oh, and last name? You're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! Shit. Hey! Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Wait, in the bathroom! <gasps> Twin Peaks. Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Go! Oh, go! Oh, I got this! <sighs> He's Get got in, decked in the face. Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! There's a lot going on. Alright. Oh, this music's pretty. This has been a long episode for me. Usually I cut it around 30 minutes, so we're at almost an hour. So that's... Life-changing. Anyway, um, thank y'all so much for watching. It's been so fun to be back. I'm so excited to be back and be playing these games. I'm going to try and put them out on more of a regular schedule at least twice a week, I think. Maybe once at the beginning of the week, once at the end.
depends whenever my editing schedule finishes. I don't know. I'll make a schedule eventually where everything's more common. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But um, thank y'all so much for watching. I really appreciate everything y'all do for me. And yeah, so I'll see y'all next time whenever I do. Like and subscribe, all that bullshit. You know how it goes. And yeah, deuces.